Hey, what's going on hockey players? In this video, I'm gonna run you through a nine minute hockey jump rope workout. So this is gonna be a workout that you can do at home. It's gonna be total body conditioning for hockey players and it's gonna be a follow along style. So I'm gonna do the workout alongside you and we're gonna have it up on the screen here as we do it. So for this workout, all we need is a jump rope, a hockey stick and something to stick handle with. I've got a stick handling ball. You can use an orange ball, road hockey ball, tennis ball, puck, doesn't really matter. Uh, make sure you do a warm up before we get into this workout. I'll leave two warm ups in the description below. Other than that, you ready to go? Let's get into it. All right, so first up, it's gonna be jump rope here. We're gonna start in five seconds. This is your standard jump rope, two feet. Ready, go, 30 seconds. If you screw up, if you hit your feet, don't worry about it. Just get the rope back up and keep going. Pick a pace that's good for you if you can pick it up. Go a little faster. If you have to slow it down, slow it down. We're gonna just do two foot jumps here. We'll move into some single legs soon. Next up is prisoner squats. All right, so we wanna put our hands behind our head. If that's too difficult, you can put your hands out in front of you. 30 seconds of this, try to get nice and low. Keep up a good pace. Try to get full extension at the top. Ten more seconds. All right, so we're gonna grab the jump ropes again. Okay, we're gonna alternate single legs here. So left foot, right foot. We're gonna do at least two hops per foot. As you get more comfortable, we can get up to five hops per foot. This is gonna help your ankles, it's gonna help your edge work out on the ice, with your ankle stability. All right, down for yoga push-ups. So a standard push-up into a downward dog. Try to get into a bit of a rhythm. All right, grab your hockey sticks. We're just gonna dangle, freestyle dangle for 30. When you feel comfortable, pick that head up. Fast as you can. It's gonna be an upper body, forearm conditioning exercise here. If you screw up like that, just pick the puck back up. We got Superman wrap today. All right, so down to the floor for some Superman reps. <laughs> Try to squeeze at the top. Okay, so freestyle. Do whatever you want. You can do high knees, you can alternate, you can do speed, whatever you want. Challenge yourself here, do some speed. Jump rope if you can. If you screw up like that, just keep going. Next we're going to do V-ups on the ground for some abs. All right, a little bit of core work here. This is gonna be tough for 30 seconds. Take a break if you need it. Try to touch if you can.
All right, 30 seconds rest. Grab a drink. All right, get ready for some more jump rope. We're gonna run through that same circuit one more time. Give it everything you got. Here we go. Jump roping, jump, or jump and rope is a good uh, warm up exercise. You can do this daily for five minutes if you want. Great for your ankle stability. Good for edge work out on the ice. Change directions quickly. Get on your inside and outside edges. All right, so hands behind your head. Prisoner squats. Try to pick up the pace here with full extension and full depth too. Your feet should almost be leaving the ground. You're going so fast up. Single leg, so alternate. You can do one and one back and forth, but try to do at least two, up to about five per leg. Just a little better challenge, making sure we have no strong foot. You don't wanna be one of the skaters that can only turn one way well. Okay, yoga push-ups. Again, try to pick up the pace here, get in a nice rhythm. All right, last dangle. Try to burn on those forearms. Head up when you feel comfortable. As fast as you can to burn those forearms out. Superman reps. Squeeze at the top here. Okay, last freestyle jump rope. Anything you want. Try to pick up the pace, give me your last lower body. Just try to pick it up if you can. I'm not, a, I'm not that good of a jump rope. God damn. All right, Mike fell out there, so I'm just gonna do some high knees. All right. New V ups here. Little malfunction there, but keep going. Push it. Oh, that's tough, okay. We're gonna do skater bounce for 30 seconds to finish it. Try to be as explosive as possible. Seven seconds. Yeah. 
Woo, let's go. All right, I just had to catch my breath there for a second. Grab yourself a drink if you haven't already. You guys deserve it. Nice work out there today. If you want an extra challenge, pick up your hockey stick and do about 10 to 20 minutes of stick handling work. That will really burn out your forearms and your upper body. Other than that, guys, uh, great job today. These workouts, these quick little workouts, aren't something that you wanna be doing all off season long. You don't wanna replace your 60 to 90 minute conditioning sessions with something like this, but they're great little workouts to have in your toolbox for the times when you can't get those full workouts in. So if you enjoy these types of videos, do me a big favor, hit that thumbs up button to let me know. I'll make more videos like this. Subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. Check out the free goal scoring package in the comment section below. And until next time, train hard guys.